The European Atlas of Access to Myeloma Treatment is a new approach to advocacy for access to treatment across Europe. So what we're trying to do at the moment is to um, develop a tool which will help our member groups to identify their own priorities in their countries depending on the resources they have and develop strategies that will actually lead them to tackle those challenges and those barriers they have identified. I think if I was to pick two or three things that were really, really important um, that the Atlas delivers would be around um, its ability to uh, generate local intelligence and local knowledge to help advocacy groups at the local level uh, sort all the problems out uh, at a local level. The Myeloma Patients Europe are really pioneering new methodology to collect um, benefit risk data that will help very, um, very nicely to articulate the true value of new medicines from a patient perspective and we hope that data will help improve access for the long term. We are now launching the Atlas coaching program which really is the third part of the ATLAS strategy. It's important to keep in mind that the ATLAS strategy has three parts. One was collecting the evidence. The second one is making it accessible. And this is very important because if we have evidence but it is not accessible for the end users, it's, not, it's just not worth it. And then to act upon it. The ATLAS coaching program will help MPE members to act upon the evidence that was already collected. The ATLAS coaching program is based on the collaborative improvement projects which is a methodology that is used by several institutions internationally to introduce changes and to help to other organizations to advocate for change. This is based on having a community of people which are interested in doing these changes and they share the experience and the process of change. So they, can, they do this from a framework that is agreed. This would be our tool, our guideline for advocacy. And then they have live sessions where they share their problems, their advances, their successes and so on.